So it's another fresh Saturday morning for us. Um, and we're gonna go in and uh, see what we can get done on our Project Hillman Husky today. Uh, we'll probably aim to get the front suspension. Ooh, wrong gear. Ooh, wrong gear again. We'll probably get, aim to get the front suspension to a, to a workable state by the end of play today. So um, yeah, we'll keep you updated on uh, photos and progress as we go. So um, yeah, stay tuned. Nathan has spent the morning stripping the front suspension out of the Husky and this is what we're left with. You see these turrets here, we're gonna cut those clean off, lose those all together um, and then we'll, through the subframe here, we'll have enough um, enough room for a bag expansion so that's not going to be an issue but we will have to fabricate complete new um, top mounts for our air shocks and then incorporate that in with a brand new top A-arm design. So, um, yeah, give us a few more hours and um, we'll have a bit more of an idea of where we're going with that. It's actually Nathan's 30th birthday today, so I thought I'd be an amazing boss and treat him to working on the Husky. What a present. What a present. <laughs> Best boss ever! Like We've just fitted the uh, lower suspension arms back up. Uh, on the spindles and um, put a mock-up wheel on here, which is going to have roughly about the same rolling radius as um, our wheel and tire combo. Um. Yeah, so stick a bit of camber on that. There we go. That's how it's going to sit. <laughs> Get it in the middle. Yeah. Well, that's roughly where it's going to sit, and. I couldn't even go much lower than that if I wanted, really. The the profile of these rear ar front arches, sorry, are a lot higher than rear arches, so. If you think that's what the rim's gonna be touching the arch at the front, on the back here, they're gonna be tucked right up. Buried. Yeah, they are gonna be buried right up inside those rear quarters. Oh, it's gonna look sick.
that's us uh, pretty much done for the day now. Um, we've made really good headway on the front suspension actually. Uh, what a day. At the minute I've just finished tacking together these little debris what's it. So that will be the top mount for our air struts. Nice. Nathan's been working on the bottom mounts. Uh, they're pretty straightforward. We can use the original A-arm uh, and we're just making a mount uh, bolt through the spherical bearing on the, the lower part. Um, for the top though, we've got to manufacture a whole new tubular A-arm, which is going to be a bit more tricky and we'll attach that. Uh, <laughs> attack. Fuck. Yeah, we're going to attack that another day. Um, we're going to use the old A-arm as a pattern to make a jig. Um, just so we keep all the geometry and everything the same. Um, yeah, it's going to come together quite nicely. Um, shot blast all, beveled it up nicely, prepped it, ready for welding. So that uh, little tube going through there replicates the width of our uh, top spherical bearing on the air shock. So bolt that together so it keeps it nice so when you weld it, it doesn't pull and go all over the place. Um, and we'll probably plate in the top of that there as well. Uh, give that a bit more strength and uh, yeah, that'll be the top mount done. Well, both top mounts Result good day. Really happy with that. About time we had some progress on the Husky um, A week and a half left of the month, so let's see where that gets us. Stay tuned